Good evening, I'm Alex, and you're watching America Headlines. Tonight, we bring you a story that could transform the future of wireless communication in the United States. This is not just another business deal. It is a turning point in how Americans will connect with each other, from the busiest cities to the most remote farmlands. In a groundbreaking announcement, SpaceX has struck a historic $17 billion agreement with EchoStar, a major player in the satellite and communication industry. The deal, which combines both cash and stock assets, could mark the beginning of a brand new era where mobile dead zones finally become a thing of the past. Yes, you heard that right. Those frustrating spots where calls drop, texts fail, or mobile data simply disappears may soon vanish forever. Thanks to cutting-edge satellite technology, SpaceX is planning to fill the gaps that traditional cell towers have never been able to cover. Let's break this down. Under the agreement, SpaceX will acquire wireless spectrum licenses from EchoStar worth about $17 billion. The payment is being split into two main categories, $8.5 billion in cash, $8.5 billion in stock. On top of that, SpaceX has agreed to cover around $2 billion of EchoStar AS debt payments stretching through 2027. For Elon Musk, AS aerospace giant, this move is more than just a purchase. It is a carefully calculated step toward controlling the future of mobile connectivity. So, how does this work? According to SpaceX President Gwynne Shotwell, this exclusive spectrum will be used to power next-generation satellites. These aren't ordinary satellites. They'll be laser-connected satellites, often described as cell towers in space. What makes them revolutionary is their ability to expand network capacity by over 100 times compared to today's systems. Imagine having 5G speeds not only in downtown Manhattan or Los Angeles, but also in rural Alaska, deep mountain valleys, or even in the middle of the desert. This is where Starlink, SpaceX's satellite internet service, ties in. Until now, Starlink has mainly focused on providing broadband internet to homes and businesses in hard-to-reach areas. With this acquisition, Starlink's capabilities will extend directly to mobile phones, bringing true nationwide coverage without depending entirely on ground-based towers. Naturally, Wall Street wasted no time responding. The news sent EchoStar's stock soaring by 19% in early trading, showing strong investor confidence in the deal. But the reaction wasn't all positive across the industry. Traditional wireless carriers felt the shock. AT&T and T-Mobile both dropped over 3%, while Verizon fell more than 2%. The market is clearly signaling that a new competitor has entered the wireless arena, one that could shake up decades of dominance by traditional telecom giants. Now, let's step away from stock prices and ask, what does this mean for everyday Americans? Consider this. Last year in 2024, Americans used a record-breaking 132 trillion megabytes of mobile data. That's a 35% jump from the year before. Our phones aren't just communication tools anymore. There are banks, our classrooms, our navigation systems, our workstations, and even our entertainment hubs. But despite this growing dependency, millions of Americans still struggle with unreliable service. Rural communities often face dead zones where calls and data simply don't work. Truck drivers traveling across state lines lose connection. Farmers managing smart agriculture tools in remote fields face disruptions, even first responders can run into dangerous communication gaps during emergencies. SpaceX's plan could change all of that. By using a web of satellites orbiting the Earth, coverage won't be limited by the number of towers on the ground. Instead, satellite-to-phone connections would provide a continuous signal almost everywhere in the country. And let's not forget, the potential goes beyond America's borders. While this deal specifically strengthens SpaceX's presence in the U.S. wireless market, the technology itself could be expanded globally. Countries struggling with poor infrastructure could leapfrog straight into satellite-powered mobile networks. For example, rural areas in Africa, mountainous regions in South America, or remote islands in the Pacific could suddenly gain access to reliable mobile coverage. That's not just a business win. It's a global connectivity revolution. Of course, big questions remain. Can SpaceX truly compete head-to-head -head with traditional telecom giants like Verizon, AT&T, and T-Mobile? These companies have decades of experience, millions of customers, and massive infrastructures. But SpaceX brings something unique to the table, innovation and speed. 
The company has already proven its ability to disrupt industries, from reusable rockets and space travel to Starlink S global satellite internet. Now, by entering the wireless space, SpaceX isn't just competing, it's redefining the playing field. Traditional carriers may be forced to lower prices, improve service quality, and expand coverage faster than ever before. For consumers, that means better service and potentially more affordable plans. That said, it won't be an easy ride. Deploying thousands of next-generation satellites requires enormous capital, regulatory approvals, and technical precision. There are also questions about interference, bandwidth management, and how these satellites will interact with existing networks. But if anyone has shown the world that the impossible can be made possible, it's Elon Musk and SpaceX. From landing rockets vertically on drone ships to building the largest constellation of satellites in orbit, the company thrives on tackling challenges that others shy away from. So what might the future look like five years from now if this project succeeds? A farmer in Kansas could live stream crop conditions directly from the field. A student in rural Montana could attend a virtual class without worrying about internet dropouts. Travelers could drive cross-country without ever losing signal. Emergency responders could coordinate seamlessly during wildfires, hurricanes, or earthquakes. This isn't just about convenience. It's about safety, progress, and leveling the digital playing field. As SpaceX moves forward with this ambitious $17 billion deal, one thing is clear. America's wireless future is on the verge of a dramatic transformation. The coming years will show whether this bold bet pays off and whether Elon Musk's vision of connecting every corner of America and eventually the world can truly become a reality. We'll be following every update on this developing story, from the satellite launches to market reactions and from consumer experiences to industry shifts. I'm Alex, and this has been America Headlines. Thank you for joining us tonight, and remember, when it comes to the future of communication, the sky is no longer the limit.